Okay, so our cell is up and running. Um, I'll run through the circuit we're using for our straight DC testing. Uh, here I have our little Variac uh, that is going into a 24 volt transformer, a heavy duty bridge rectifier, and a 10,000 UF 63 volt smoothing cap. And um, this meter here is reading our voltage across the cell and that meter there is reading the current into the cell and of course we have our cell there our reservoir coming out of the reservoir and going into our bubbler now that does look like a lot of bubbles but it is just over a half a litre a minute so we'll say half a litre a minute we're doing at the moment that um, flow meter has been recalibrated for HHO and they do that by putting a different weight pill in there um, it was done in China and donated to me by a man by the name of Alan Narwood I think it was a long time ago um, he lives in China and he got it recalibrated for HHO gas, not um, O2 as it says. And we'll find out later on when we set up our um, displacement test using our bottles that that is very accurate. And we can also get a uh, MMW reading from all this. We would expect that cell to do somewhere between 6.5 and 7 on the MMW. So we have 4.7 average on our current 16.6 volts across the cell. And like I said, we're a bit over half a litre a minute. Very close to it, but Um, from that we can get an idea as to what that cell does as far as um, our MMW goes at that voltage and that current of course we'll be trying uh, raising the current see if it does any better or it does any worse we'll be doing all that once we get our um, displacement measuring device set up so um, at the moment we're simply using our flow gauge so uh, just on half a litre a minute 4.78 volts that's uh, 4.78 amps on average and 16.6 volts across the cell so uh, we can calculate our MMW from that alright so uh, that's just this is just a quick video quick run and um, we're still yet to finish our setup we'll be coming out of that flow gauge and uh, going into our uh, displacement gauge which of course is the uh, bottle how long it takes to fill up a one litre bottle and um, once again we can calculate our MMW from our meters and also see how close it is um, as far as being accurate with this flow meter here Alright, thanks for watching guys, and uh, we will see you in the next video. Okay, so we just done a, a quick calculation, and I'll add this on to the end of the video. Uh, MMW for half a litre a minute. Um, going on, uh, that's actually dropped a little bit now. But um, from the calculations and the numbers in the video just a while ago, uh, we have an MMW of about 6.3 and that was going on the uh, half a litre a minute side we're slightly higher than that so um, we're very close to the 6.5 we would expect from this cell so, um, that's also a good indication that that flow meter is fairly accurate 
Alright, um, that's it for now. During the week I'll get the rest of the setup all made up and um, we can start using our displacement tests, get some uh, very accurate numbers. But at the moment the cell is doing what it is expected to do, or I would expect it to do. And uh, although that looks like a lot of gas, as you can see it is only half a litre a minute. Okay, thanks for watching guys, and uh, we'll see you again soon.